it's almost like playoff hockey every night. How is that preparing you? Um, it's awesome. It's uh, obviously a good test. Um, playing these games, these hard-fought games, uh, you got to play for a full 60 minutes. So I think uh, just finding that and uh, bringing it consistently. Kyler, where have you felt the biggest growth in your game so far? Uh, probably just confidence with the puck. Um, I've been able to use my speed and my body a little bit more lately uh, in the second half. Um, so I think that's been uh, giving me a little extra boost and uh, um, the confidence to do a little bit more. Does that come from just experience and playing more or, or something else? Yeah, I think it has to do a lot with that. Um, obviously, um, getting just reps and uh, seeing things in game, watching uh, video clips, uh, breaking down the game. Um, anything you can do to really uh, um, make those small adjustments in game or uh, out on practice and stuff like that. So um, I think that's the biggest thing for me. Are there any particular adjustments that you've made that, that have made a, a big impact or that you work on? Uh, I mean, nothing consistent, uh, uh, consistently, I guess. Um, I guess the most thing is just keeping my body right, um, doing things away from the, away from the ice, uh, to stay in shape and uh, keep my body healthy. What changes have you made in that, in that aspect? Um, I think just uh, taking care of my body a little bit more, eating, eating a little bit better, um, stretching a little bit more, rolling out a little bit more, just the little things. Kendra, okay, you're a first rounder, but you wait two years before jumping into the NHL, playing at Wisconsin. Uh, Alexi is also, is also a first rounder, first pick overall. Could you say that the difference of pressure might be different when your first pick overall versus 20-ish pick five? Uh, I don't really think so. No, um, I think uh, everybody has a has a job to do when they step on the ice, and uh, I think it's just about bringing that same energy and um, that compassion every night. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously we got drafted different years at different orders, um, but I don't think. That should change much about how we play, how we play the game. You know him pretty well. I think you were living with, with Alex last year. Uh, what are you seeing with the way Alex is playing at his second season? Yeah, Loff has been unbelievable this, this second half. Um, he's really uh, stepped up and uh, contributed to the team a great amount. So it's it's really cool to see, and uh, I'm happy for him. Um, you see it uh, day in and day out. Um, his worth ethic uh, in practice and when he gets to the rink, um, he can just kind of flip that switch and uh, yeah, do him. I mean, it's nothing nothing crazy, um, but he's been really good. With you, it's obviously defense first, but do you know about your, your, your comfort level now being more offensive? Uh, a little bit, yeah, it's coming. Um, it's That's all I can really say right now, it's coming. Um, Obviously, it's it's frustrating every once in a while, uh, not putting up the points. But um, I think that stuff will come uh, with good play. Are you surprised how far you've come in such a short period of time? Um, yeah, I, I would say that. Um, being obviously in college for those two years prepared me to make this jump. Um, and I think uh, the guys that we have around the locker room are uh, a great support system. And um, we just have great guys in the locker room that can uh, that you can talk to and uh, break down the game with. So I think that's uh, one of the biggest things for me is learning um, from those older guys with experience and uh, growing that into my game. You talked about using your body more. Do you get a sense that, that, you, that you're now more physical, that you're getting under guys' skin? skin. Um, yeah, I mean, that's part of the game, I guess. Um, um, it's happened a couple times recently, um, throwing the body around and uh, Guys take exception a little bit, but um, yeah, I guess it's just part of the game. Is that that? Is there some dissatisfaction that you're getting under that you're annoying guys? Uh, I mean, anytime you can get it in uh, someone's head uh, for a shift or two, um, that'll hopefully help uh, help the momentum, kind of shut them down, and uh, like I said, just get in their head and uh, throw them off a little bit.